Hi, hello, thank you for clicking on this video. Today I'm going to do my first introduction for the Panda Palette project. I'm going to do this project during 2021, but I'm going to start in 2020, at least the intro. But all the updates are going to be in 2021, and I'm going to try to pan this palette, or at least I'm going to try to hit pan in all the shades in this palette. You already probably saw the palette in the thumbnail or in the title, so this is really not a surprise. So. This is the palette that I'm going to be working on. It's the Mother Renaissance palette by Anastasia Beverly Hills and I'm super excited to work with this palette for 2021. This is a palette that I really really love. I really love the looks that I create with it but I don't use it enough. Because it is one of the most expensive palettes in my collection, I tend to not use it because it's like ugh, I don't want to use it, you know? But I'm going to try to hit pen in all of the shades. I'm not going to try to actually pen the totality of the palette because that would be insane for me, but I'm, at least I'm going to try to hit pen because as you can see this palette, it seems totally new, so I'm just going to try to hit pen in all of the 14 shades and I'm super excited for that. I never did this type of project. I only did the Pendles Eyeshadows project and I love that project because of all the randomness of it, all the random eyeshadows that you have to work on. And before starting that project, I really didn't know about the Panda palette project because I didn't know a palette that would like be the correct <laughs> the correct palette to use in this project, but after having some eyeshadows in the Pandos eyeshadows, I noticed that this palette, the shadows that I have in this palette, I feel like I want to use them only with this palette. For example, the other shades, I don't mind using a shade from one palette and a shade from another palette. But when it came to this palette, I was like, no, I really want to use a shade in here with another shade in here so I feel like that's a good thing for a panda palette but of course if I feel like I want to use other shades from other palettes I'll do that but for this one I will think I'll stick to this palette only but you never know but I feel like this palette will be super good for me I've seen a lot of people doing this project as well with this palette so that was kind of an inspiration. I think my first inspiration was Rachel Stephanie. I'll link her down below and you can see her project. But yeah, my palette is super like new. But you can do like neutral looks, more pinky looks, more orangey looks, more brown looks. You can do a lot of different looks and I'm really curious to see how this is going to go. I'll probably have a goal for each month, for each update, but for now I think I just want to play with them and get to know them a little bit. Right now, December, I'm not working on my Pandas eyeshadows, eyeshadows <laughs> because I finished it and I'm going to keep doing it in 2021 but now I have a month to only work on this palette so that is amazing for me to get to know these shades yeah I'm just curious about working with the shades I don't have a specific goal I think well I could have I could make a goal I could make at least a goal to use at least every shade one time. I think that would be a good goal. I think it is well, <laughs> I think it is easy for me to reach that goal because 14 shades I can use more than one shade per look so I think it is possible for me to use all of the shades in December but we'll see <laughs> but I'm super curious. So that will be the palette that I'll be working on in 2021 if I hit pen in every shade, that will be amazing. I don't know if that will be possible because I was working on the Pandos eyeshadows for a year and uh, I only hit pen in two shades. So I don't really know how this is going to go, but 
because of the beginning of the year I wasn't doing the best but then like I think it was October or September or October I started to use more and more and more and now I feel a lot more confident with doing this project and doing the pandas eyeshadows then and I feel like I'll be able to use all of the eyeshadows but yeah we'll see you you'll see that with me <laughs> today is or should be December 7 and I'm thinking about doing this project probably every month so every seventh day of the month I'll do this project I feel like that will be a good way I don't know like I have to see how it goes if I feel like I don't have a lot of progress every month I'll probably do it every two months but for now I think I'll do it every month so in a month you'll be able to see how this first intro went if I was able to use all of them I think I'll be able to use all of them but yeah I'm hoping to have a lot of fun with this palette it's a palette that I really really love but I feel like I don't use it a lot I I really don't <laughs> like uh, probably this year like yeah it it's shameful the amount of times I use this this year so I'm not going to say it <laughs> but it is a super low number like low 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 and yeah I want to use it more and at least hit pen in all of the shades I feel like that for me is enough and pen that palette could be hit pen in that palette <laughs> so yeah if you're doing this project as well please tell me which palette you're working on or link me to your video because I really want to see it and yeah I hope you enjoy it if you don't want to miss any of my updates please subscribe to my channel I will be also doing the Pando's eyeshadows project as I said before so you can also see that project I'm doing the project 10 uses lipstick edition as well but that one I don't have a set date to do an update so you might as well just subscribe to my channel and wait <laughs> for the update but I also do other videos or random videos so if you do want to subscribe to my channel I'd love it and yeah that was it for the video it was super short and sweet but i hope you liked it i hope you have an amazing day and i'll see you next time bye